Oh my God. Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Tim Kidwell Outdoors. Why am I not outside fishing with Tyler? Well, this is why I'm not outside fishing right now. Yeah. Honestly guys, it has been raining all week down here in Florida and it's gonna keep raining. So this weekend I was supposed to go down and fish with Captain Dave Schneider with Apex Bassing. However, due to obvious reasons, not gonna be able to make that trip this time, but it will be coming up very soon. So, what's the point of today's video? Well, the time that Tyler and I went fishing out in the kayaks, I never got a chance to edit that. But before we do the whole video, I wanna go ahead and answer a few questions that I had in my last video about the kayak. All right, so the number one question that I got, I got it from Robbie AM Fishing, and I got it from uh, Jerry Skywalker, and actually a few other people. Okay, so to answer your question, does the transducer read through the kayak? Yes, it freaking does, it's insane. I don't know how it does it, but the transducer actually does read through the kayak. However, and this is a very important thing, that you have to put some water into the actual foam piece that the transducer sits in every time. The transducer always has to sit in water in order for it to read properly. Why? I don't know, but it does. So if you guys are having issues, try that, and that should actually help your issues. I'm gonna go ahead and stop talking. Let's, where'd it go? Where'd it go? There, there. All right, let's get to the video. It's right there. All right, this looks like a nice spot to start off with. Wind would stop blowing me everywhere. That would be great. First fish of the day, and it's a baby one. Okay. Not very big at all. Oh well, three minutes in, already got a fish. Look at that. All right, look, I hooked him right here and it just popped out. All right, sick. See ya. baby fish not necessarily what I'm looking for oopsies there we go but a fish nonetheless all right see ya I think there's like a drop off right here Yeah, I think there's a drop off right there, bro, because I see like four or five of them on the Garmin. I'm like, I know that there's a freaking thing right here, right in the middle. All right, Tyler over there got a fish, and I got a nice fish. All right, thank you, Garmin, for showing me that. See you, buddy. Man, they're all little, bro. All right, see you, pal. 
Hey guys, look what y'all just missed. Yep, I'm a dummy. I didn't hit the record button, but so far, this is the nicest fish I've caught today. And it was over by that branch over there. Dang, I wish I would've been able to get that on film. All right, see ya. Oh my god! Got him! <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> Dude, he got me soaked! <laughs> oh, oh my god! Oh wow, I am completely soaked! Holy crap! This dude's got some power! Oh wow, okay. All right, this one is definitely the biggest one today. He's a fighter, jeez. Holy cow. This is a really nice fish. All right, see ya. Don't splash again. Yeah, got the hook out of his mouth. All right. I honestly have no idea how many fish this is, but he is alive, he's safe, he's back in the water. See ya. Gotcha, buddy. Right in the boat. The hell? I really don't know what that is. I don't think it's his. Or maybe it is his, I don't know. But I hooked him here. So I don't know what that's from. Oh, yep. That's definitely his. All right, you're probably the biggest fish I've caught today. Nah, maybe second, I don't know. I've caught so many today, I lost count. See ya. Uh -huh.